five of the world's most powerful antibiotics that don't require a prescription. The truth behind the ideal health state is hidden in this simple secret that Dr. Maggie Luther North Dakota decided to share with us. Nowadays, antibiotics have become the number one solution for almost any infection or illness, but they seem to work less and less lately. The overconsumption of antibiotics has led us to resistance, according to which almost 2 million people in America only have been affected by antibiotic resistant bacteria, whereas almost 23,000 people will suffer lethal consequences as a result. MRSA is very included in the superbugs and alongside it, there are also Clostridium difficile, drug-resistant Neisseria gonorrhea and Streptococcus pneumonia, fluconazole-resistant Candida, and others. As a result of antibiotic resistance, we are now witnessing multi-drug-resistant tuberculosis and other impairments that would normally help fight off HIV and malaria. How do we solve this? First off, Antibiotics cannot solve that many problems and especially won't if you mix them simultaneously. You need to take them carefully, and that is if you really have to. In order to deal with issues like benign problems, viral infections, the cold, the flu, earaches, chest congestion and more, you can always go for natural options that will not bring side effects of any sort. Five of the world's most powerful antibiotics that don't require a prescription. Raw honey. Honey falls among the healthiest natural foods you can consume. Even better, when it is raw, it means it possesses amino acids, B vitamins, minerals, enzymes, antioxidants, and antimicrobial compounds. Furthermore, honey is packed with B pollen and propolis that strengthen the immunity and help the body heal properly. Raw honey has been especially beneficial in treating cough in children and improving their sleep immensely. The same is true for cases of diabetes and cases of ulcers. Raw honey is used in form of a prophylactic to treat individuals that are scheduled for cataract surgery or other kinds of post-operative issues. Raw honey also works amazingly as a painkiller and is very favorable to use after tonsils removal as well as during a diet and in case of insomnia. Raw honey can also treat MRSA, methicillin-resistant Staphylococcus aureus. And as research shows Manuka honey from New Zealand is the richest honey type in methyl glyoxyl. This compound provides mighty antimicrobial effect that can easily treat MRSA. Although raw honey is very healthy, children under the age of 2 are not advised to consume it since it may lead to botulism. Oil of oregano. Oregano oil is extremely healthy and beneficial for our well-being. It is especially recommended in treating colds and the flu. Since it has strong antibacterial, antiviral and antifungal properties, it can deal with the winter stomach bug and can be also used to clean the house with it. The oregano oil can destroy body parasites with ease. And as research shows, only 600 mg is sufficient for consumption during 6 weeks period. If you are dealing with a cold or the flu, you can take one 500 mg capsule per day. For more severe problems, consume three 500 mg capsules per day in separate doses. For further use, you can always dilute one two drops of oregano oil in a teaspoon of carrier oil, olive, coconut, and almond. Apply this topically, and it will help you get rid of fungi, athlete's foot or ringworm. To cleanse the sinuses and treat infections, you can steam a couple of oregano oil drops and breathe over it. Beware of allergies, though oregano oil can cause allergic reaction if you are also allergic to plants that belong to the Lamiaceae family. Coconut oil. As of recently, coconut oil has become even more popular and people are now getting to learn its true qualities. Aside from being full of healthy fats, coconut oil is an excellent antibiotic and can act as a pure antimicrobial agent. The top fatty acids that provide this are lauric acid, capric acid, and caprylic acid. As you may already know, coconut oil is incredible treatment for the hair and skin, not only cosmetically but also in health-related situations. 
This oil can quickly deal with issues such as atopic dermatitis, eczema, staphylococcus aureus and redness of any sort. Interestingly enough, all these mostly occur as a result of antibiotic overuse. Garlic, one of the most powerful natural antibiotics has to be garlic. It is highly recommended by doctors and scientists as one, if the best solutions for treating colds, the flu, and fungal infections. One study, which took 90 days to develop, examined the aged garlic extract, age, and proved that the cold and flu affected patients cannot tell the difference between placebo and age. This proves that going natural is the best option. To use and apply garlic properly, you have to give it 10-15 minutes before actually using it. It is stated that the oxygen found in the air will activate the allicin, a highly important compound. If you are cooking it, throw in the garlic just 5 minutes before you're done with cooking so it doesn't lose its qualities. Echinacea, E. purpurea and E. angustifolia. The Echinacea herb is among the most amazing antibacterial and anti-inflammatory remedies that are totally genuine. In the past, this herb has been used to heal snackabites since it provides antibacterial, antiviral and antiseptic properties. Echinacea contains polysaccharides that activate the immunity and revive the organism. However, this herb is not recommended for treating colds or the flu. Still, in case of respiratory diseases, you can always feel free to use it as much as you want. In case you are having an allergic reaction to plants in the Asteraceae family, you may experience the same with Echinacea as well. This herb is also very incompatible in case of autoimmune diseases and HIV. There you have it. Next time, before trying over-the-counter antibiotics, think of these natural remedies and give them a try it will be totally worth it.